Hello everyone, welcome back on Instagram channel, guys. I am Ramkesh Singh, Unity game developer, YouTuber, and vlogger. We are doing the series of Unity addressable. So we have done four parts. Those are very important parts. So if you have not watched, so please watch one by one so that you can grab all the concept, all the knowledge. In this tutorial, what we are going to discuss? We are going to discuss a very important thing. As you know that we have done the going the progress bar from uh, downloading of addressable. We have done the taking the cache memory. Thing is coming that when you have when you have many scene like 30 40 or 10 5 scene so at that time what happens is that our downloading speed get slower i am going to tell you that at how many ways we can increase the speed of download so that our player have to not wait for longer time so i am requesting that if you are new on the channel make sure you subscribe the channel and if you want to support me join or you can give me thanks on that particular video so let's start the today video how to make download speeds fast and what's the use of groups in downloading speed Let's suppose currently we have one scene and that is not big size so it takes a very less time and currently we are using only default local group let's suppose we have 25 scenes every scene size is 350 mb and if you are going to make addressable so what will take so if if one scene size is 350 mb so you can calculate that if you multiply by 25 so it will be a very huge amount and that amount uh, will be take lots of time to download what we can do we can do two things one is we add cdn you can search about cdn so this is the content delivery you can use cdn what is the cdn content delivery network basically what it does is that it is just getting downloaded from your nearest server whenever you are using uh, s3 or any uh, azure server so it will download from nearest server let's suppose i am in india so in india is nearest server is mumbai so we will get download in mumbai let's suppose you are from the us so it will be get download from us if you are going to download from mumbai so it will take longer time and the second option basically addressable provide is just what we have done you can see currently we are doing default group in default group we have added one scene i am adding multiple scene like two three and let's suppose i am making addressable this addressable similarly i'm adding 25 scene in default group so it will download all the 25 scene at a one time okay if we are doing in the same group we are doing in the same group so what is the right way to do the right way to do is create a group let's suppose so how we can create the group because unity addressable let's suppose you are giving the name load addressable test map 3 so if it is in default group so it will download all the three scenes all other three scenes at once so what we want we want that if we are doing test map 3 so at a one time only test map 3 download and other scene will be download next time so it depend on your scenario but if you have bigger size scene so it is compulsory to download one by one because at a one time if you will download that will take lots of time okay so what we can do we have to create different group so basically addressable download group why so let's suppose so i can give the name the scene 2 and let's create another in 3 basically we have created default group scene 2 scene 3 scene 2 should be in scene 2 and scene 3 should be scene 3 now you can see every group have different asset means different asset scene whenever you will call asset 2 addressable load dot scene 2 so it will, it will load it will download scene 2 group and whenever you will write load in 3 so it will download 3 so basically what will happen is just we have divided 25 scene in different group so that's why it will download on that particular time so it will not download all the 25 scene at once means that will take very longer time so you have to create the group so this is the advantage of group in terms of your unity addressable scene as well as your unity assets so i have explained two things to you it may be scenario that your scene is very big might be the reason that your text size is very very high size so at that time you can reduce according to your platform like in oculus like in your system like your mobile game so on the basis of that you have to optimize so that your scene size be very less this is the standard way to do use the cdn second is that you have to divide in group groups hope you enjoy hope you learn something and thanks for watching have a good day see you next video bye bye take care